Today I want to show you one of our standard products. It's our EC1103A cutaway 4x4 drivetrain with automatic transmission. Now this trainer has been developed from the ground up just for teaching. And we've also developed ways for you and your students to interact with the trainer that are more intuitive and hands-on. This is from a Ford Ranger or Mazda B-Series pickup truck. And we've got the entire drivetrain right from the torque converter out to the axle shafts. We'll start off with uh, the control panel. We'll turn it on. And contrary to other models, we've got a gear selector. And we have different, you'll see these LED lights that demonstrate the different components. So we've got three bands and three clutches. You can see them here. Here, let's select first gear. And we'll see that there's just a forward clutch that's engaged. Now we'll add in, uh, we'll put it to fifth gear. Now in fifth gear, we can see we've got the front band, the forward clutch, and the direct clutch. And you can go through all the different gear ratios. You can have your students go through and calculate them out. Uh, if you look here, we've got, you can see these red lines showing on different components that allow the students to calculate the gear ratios. Now you'll notice in the control panel that we don't just have first through fifth, we also have reverse, and we have manual one and manual two. So we can show the difference of having the coast clutch engaged or not the coast clutch engaged. Now let's take a closer look at some of the components. We'll start right at the front. We'll look at the front differential. It's an open diff, very simple, easy to teach. If we work our way back, now we can look at the torque converter. Now this is a lockup torque converter. You can see here the lockup clutch. On this side here, you can see the internals of the torque converter. And just behind it, if you look here, it's a little bit harder to see, but we also have the gear pump is cut away. As we're going along the transmission, you can see all the different bands and clutches, and we do have a cutaway allowing us to see the clutch engage and disengage. And of course, we can see all the bands as well. Moving further along, we can see now the transfer case. And with the transfer case, it's electronically controlled, and we can see the two different forks. Moving to the back, here we can see, again, now we've got another differential. This time, it's a limited slip differential. And if we kind of step back a little bit and look from afar, you can see the entire system all spinning away, and we can see details of the driveline angles, and we can really give the students a full explanation. And the beauty of this is that at any given time during your class, you can just set it and forget it and let the students walk around, look at it, do their calculations and study it to really get the light bulbs on in their heads to understand how the system works. Now let's talk about one of the most important things for you as a teacher, for your school and for your students, safety. Now you'll notice the entire product is enclosed in a plexiglass enclosure with an emergency stop button on top. This means that you can leave the product functioning with your students. Even if you have an open house with people that aren't mechanically inclined, you can feel comfortable uh, leaving the product there unattended and you can just let it run along and do a demonstration with it. As you have seen, this product can make your life easier as a teacher. To find out more about our products, visit constlab.com or you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, or LinkedIn. Thanks for watching.